everyone, welcome to my channel, A Dive Into The World Of NASCAR. I'm your host, Steven. Today's episode, we'll be talking about the basics of NASCAR. Okay, to get things settled, this is not a racing series. It's a sanctioning body that owns these. This is how the rules are formed, staff work, media relations, and the owners and managers. And these? These are the racing divisions where the actual racing happens. But there are a bunch of racing series with the NASCAR name in it, so I have to cut it down to the main three you hear in the news. This one is the most, most important. It's every NASCAR driver's dream to race in. It has the big events you hear about on TV, like the Daytona 500. I'll make a separate video for this division. Anyway, most drivers begin on go-karts, but they progress into stock car drivers. Most NASCAR drivers start years before they get into the big leagues. You have two options to choose. The first one is to prove yourself at a nearby track, if you have one in your local area, or go national in the ASA late model series. This will help you get used to the bigger stock cars. And then they move up to ARCA, they have three choices to choose from, Arca Truck Series, the Arca Menard Series West, and the Arca Menard Series East. Once they finish in one of those, they can compete in the Arca Menard Series. Finally, after a few years of racing, they enter the big leagues. The NASCAR Truck Series is basically training wheels and will teach all the drivers what they need to know. And their career direction at this point is in their car owner's hands. Most drivers go to the NASCAR Xfinity Series next. But sometimes, if a driver is good enough, he can be promoted to the NASCAR Cup Series, the biggest division of- Thank you for watching. I hope you now know something about NASCAR. Goodbye!